people do at this time of year. They join a gym or a health club to shed some of that holiday weight. Yeah, and sometimes choosing the right gym isn't so easy. Investigator Joe Ducey lets you know how to avoid the most common mistakes. Have you looked around your gym lately? It's likely much busier than it was a month ago. This is the time a lot of us make an effort to lose some weight and get in shape. While there's some good health clubs with good deals, there are also gym horror stories. They signed me up for a personal um, trainer, and the person was never around. And uh, but when I tried to get out of it, it cost me $250 to get out of the contract. I would prefer going on a month by month basis. Because um, I obviously don't use it as much as I should. Before you sign any contract, ask about penalties if you cancel. Make sure to get everything in writing. If it's verbal and not written down, you have no proof. Pay by check or credit card. Don't let the gym debit your account monthly. It's much harder to quit. Consumer Reports says you should also ask to try out a gym for free for a few days. Check it out at the times you might be going to see if it's too crowded for you. And remember, you can try to negotiate a better deal. Sometimes that means paying no upfront sign up fees. If you can, avoid lengthy contracts and go month to month. You have much more control, but it will likely cost you a little bit more. Arizona does have health club laws to protect you, including that you may cancel the contract in writing within three business days of signing up. Go to abc15.com slash let Joe know to see all of your protections before you sign. Need my help? Call me, email me, or find me on Facebook or Twitter. I'm Investigator Joe Ducey. If you've got a problem, let me know.